Rock and roll. Yeah, I'm good. I will introduce you. Are you ready? Are you ready? Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, please silence your cell phones and remain standing for the national anthem sung by the Hermerson High School Chamber Choir, directed by Miss Bemrose. As the choir exits, an outstanding job, by the way. Can we also give a big thank you to the band uh, that played a few minutes ago as well, please? Thank you for being here. First off, I'd like to introduce Heavenly Coleman to give this evening's welcome. Thank you, Mr. Spoo. Good evening, I am Heavenly Coleman. I was honored to have served as the 2022-2023 class president and am privileged to have been able to represent all students and be recognized as the first black student body president. Take a moment to think about all the people whose love helped get us here today including our family, friends, the ones who cannot be here today, educators, and school board members. Thank you for being here through, this, through the last four years of this roller coaster ride. I'm humbly honored to welcome all of you, and most importantly, my fellow classmates, the class of 2023. As we know, we all started from the very bottom, but looks like the whole team is here. Our class has faced many challenges, like losing absolutely every class competition, but men's volleyball, shout out to our boys for that. But through the obstacles we've endured, we can now find ourselves gathered here today to celebrate. We began our high school experience freshman year, just as we were beginning to find our identity. 
But then we were rudely interrupted by the pandemic, and suddenly high school turned into trying to stay awake for online school and sharing answers through Snapchat. For some of us, we learned about balance, valuing our relationships, and how to appreciate the conditions around us. Overall, our class got educated. At the end of our sophomore year, we came back, which was a little rocky and disrupted by having to still wear masks, but by the end of junior, weir, junior year, we could finally see each other's faces and understand what mask fishing was. We continued to unite and understand each other. In our time at school, we experienced far too many fire and lockdown drills that did not end up being drills. Experiencing this adversity has prepared our generation to address these problems and become peacemakers, change makers, and problem solvers. We have finished this journey we call high school, and tomorrow we will begin a new one. Now it's time to take on the world and pursue our passions. No matter if you, you will be furthering your education at a college or university, learning a trade or embarking on a career, I urge you to take that step. I urge you to flip that, the, that page to the next chapter, and I urge you to take pride in how far, you have, how far you've come and have confidence in how far you will go. And don't forget to live in every moment. Class of 2023, I leave you with this quote that may not have made Roman's legendary quote wall, but I hope it makes yours. Here's to the nights we felt alive. Here's to the tears you knew to cry. Here's to goodbye. Congratulations, class of 2023. And for the last time, go dogs. Thank you. Next, I would like to introduce Giovanni Cisneros to give the Spanish welcome. Thank you, Heavenly. Quiero empezar por darle las gracias a todos ustedes por estar aquí esta noche para celebrar 12 años de aprendizaje, de cambio y de crecimiento. Estamos reunidos aquí no solo para honrar este logro, sino también para celebrar todo el apoyo brindado de nuestros maestros, amigos, padres y todos los que no han podido llegar aquí. Gracias por todos sus esfuerzos. Gracias a todos sus esfuerzos. Um, desarrollamos las habilidades necesarias para comenzar nuestro futuro. Hemos subido las escaleras de la vida, convirtiéndonos en los jóvenes adultos que somos hoy. Ha llegado el momento de que todos nos tomemos un momento para repasar todo lo que hemos vivido, desde nuestra infancia hasta nuestras fases emocionales en la secundaria, cuando nuestros padres nos tenían que dar un poquito más de paciencia, hasta todo lo que hemos pasado en estos últimos cuatro años. De esta experiencia, aprendí de todos mis compañeros y maestros que hay mucha esperanza, amor y luz en este mundo. Ha sido un honor haber aprendido todas esas cualidades de nuevo. Esos fueron los valores que me permitieron tener la valentía para hablar frente a todos ustedes esta noche. Y aunque puede que no sea cercano con todos mis compañeros, hay algo que les tengo que decir a todos ustedes. Todos me han ayudado, de una manera u otra, a descubrir algo invaluable. La verdad, el compañerismo y la identidad. Mis tres valores fundamentales. Y a eso digo esto. La verdad es que todos ustedes son individuos asombrosos, destinados a la grandeza en varios caminos de la vida. Individuos que le han demostrado a todo el mundo que son imparables, indomables. Individuos que cambiarán todo el mundo un día a la vez. Y si incluso verlo sería una dificultad en el futuro, no le temo a eso porque, como somos compañeros, tenemos una conexión por toda la vida. Una conexión que ha reflejado quiénes somos ante el mundo. Y eso creó nuestra identidad, no solo en la nuestra como personas, sino que también la identidad de nuestra clase, 
los Bulldogs del 2023. Gracias y bienvenidos. Next, I would like to introduce Mr. Tom Spoo, principal of Hermiston High School. Thank you. Good evening, senior class of 2023, parents, family members, and staff who are fortunate to be here this evening and are watching via live stream. We are here this evening to honor our students and recognize the fact that they have made it. At the conclusion of this ceremony, 340 Hermiston High School graduates will walk across this stage. Before we get started, I would like to recognize several people and groups for their contributions to all that we celebrate. Dr. Trish Mooney, Superintendent. Mr. Jake Bacon, Assistant Superintendent. Our School Board, Chairman, Ms. Ginny Holthus. Vice Chair, Ms. Karen Sherman. Second Vice Chair, Ms. Sally Hansel. Board Members, Ms. Liliana Gomez, Mr. Dane Gardner, Ms. Bonnie Luisi, and Ms. Terry Vanderstelt. Teachers. <laughs> Teachers, classified employees, and administrators, all of you have worked hard over the past 13 years inside and outside of the classroom to provide our graduates with a premier educational environment that has prepared them for their post-high school lives. As a district, we also recognize how important our parent partnerships are. Without your unwavering support of the students, none of this would be possible. A round of applause for our parents, please. The class of 2023 is accomplished in terms of significant academic ac recognition. This year, we are naming two valedictorians, this being the first class where a weighted GPA policy was in effect. You can recognize them as they wear their valedictorian medals. We have 27 receiving honor, an honors diploma, an indication that they have met the most rigorous standards. They are identified by the honors medallion around their neck. In addition, we have 59 seniors graduating with honors. 185 programs of study were recognized. Program of study completers are wearing the stole color of their program. You will notice by the stoles that many of the students have completed more than one program of study. We have seven students who have met the standards that allow them to be admitted into the military in one of four different service branches. These students are identified by the red, white, and blue cords. <laughs> Financially, we have 53 seniors. We had 53 seniors report 2.8 million in scholarships received Nearly 1.3 of the 2.83 or 2.8 million reported were from seniors who took the path of scholarships workshop, and 157,000 was reported was awarded by the local scholarship committees in Hermiston and Umatilla County. A round of applause for those, please. <laughs> Lastly, parting words from myself as your principal: Seniors, follow your heart, work hard. When you think that you have reached the pinnacle, get a good night's sleep and work even harder the next day. This philosophy has worked well for many of your parents, your grandparents, and their parents before them. Become a person of character, ethics, and a good moral compass. Stay humble. Respect yourself, your family, your neighbors, your community, and your country. Thank you. Next, I'd like to introduce Ms. Layla Lucas to give the class history. You may be asking yourselves, why is the person who only went to Hermiston for half of their high school career giving the history speech? What authority do they have to speak about our class's history if they weren't even here for the half of it? I didn't really know what to do, so I took a survey. And here's what I found out. There's something called collective memory, kind of like the Mandela effect. We all remember having the same childhood. For instance, 48% of us know what the vomit popcorn bowl is. Seems like our parents all had the same idea, albeit gross. So here is the class of 2023's childhood according to my survey. 
We all enjoyed a lot of the same shows, like Wonder Pets or SpongeBob, Live and Maddie and Good Luck Charlie, The Backyardigans, Yo Gabba Gabba, or if you didn't have cable, your jam was probably Dragon Tales or Clifford. We all know the Reese's Puffs commercial by heart and are haunted by J.G. Wentworth with 877 cash now engraved into the deepest parts of our memory. I know just by mentioning that, I'm giving some of you flashbacks. When TV bored us, we would play with our Lala Loopsies, Barbies, and Lincoln Logs. When we got to school, we would get far too competitive in Foursquare. And for the record, cherry bombs are, in fact, illegal. <laughs> Every classroom got overrun by fidget spinners, slime, and silly bands. And we all know that one kid who would try to make a profit off of these trends. In retrospect, schoolyard slime chops are really gross. The world began to evolve and the internet became more relevant, meaning we all established an unhealthy obsession with YouTubers. Markiplier, Jacksepticeye, popular MMOs, dude perfect. The list could go on forever about when it comes to our favorite YouTube sensations. We all loved Vine and mourned its death. For the rest of all time, we will look at all those chickens, know that we have a basketball game tomorrow, and be sure that the road works ahead. Our chronic onlineness only got worse in 2020, where our lives became nothing but Animal Crossing and Doom. And we most definitely attended all of our online Zoom classes. <laughs> we didn't do that great that year, and some of us almost gave up. But look at us now. We're here and about to graduate. From Hot Wheels to Nyan Cat to bad TikTok trends, we are finally here. I know I missed half of the Hermiston High School career, but I didn't miss being a kid, and neither did any of you. I now leave the class of 2023 with one last thing. You just lost the game. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Next, I would like to introduce Haley Gardner to give the class prophecy. Thank you, Layla. I would like to begin by thanking everyone here for attending tonight. This is a special moment and you all are here to celebrate. Thank you to the families, friends, and lovely Hermeson High School staff that have made all of this possible. We would seriously not be here tonight without each and every one of you. This may be the end of a chapter, but it's just the beginning of the book. As I look out to the faces of the graduating class of 2023, I see bright smiles and even brighter futures. Most, if not all of you, can agree that you're ready to move on to bigger and better things and escape high school once and for all. Looking ahead may be scary or uncertain, but also exciting and new. New adventures that come with living off of top ramen for a month or getting lost in an unfamiliar place, who wouldn't want that? New friendships and new places, new achievements and new goals. New, oh sorry. <laughs> Seek new opportunities because you may never get them again. Take a chance and risk it, why not? Ralph Waldo Emerson once said, do not go where the path may lead, go instead where there is no path and leave a trail. With that being said, don't be afraid to lead yourself in a different direction because soon others will follow. Be courageous and don't look back. I don't doubt that the class of 2023 will go off to do great things. Keep dreaming and never be afraid to try new things. Set high goals for yourself because if you don't, who will? Be confident in who you are and the person you are becoming. Nothing, and I mean nothing, is impossible. I mean, we just survived 13 years of school. Who, what can't we do? After tonight, you all will have taken another step towards your future. I hope that you all are excited for the journey ahead, and remember, this may be the end of a chapter, but it's just the beginning of the book. Only you have the power to write your own. So what will the next chapter of your book look like? Thank you. Next, I would like to introduce Dr. Trisha Mooney, Superintendent of Schools. Thank you, Haley. Class of 2023, 
I am honored to be here this evening to share in what is for each of you the end of one chapter and the beginning of the next. Look to your left and look to your right. Tonight is the last night that you will all be here together as a class. Enjoy every minute. As you move on to your next chapter, whatever that is, know that you leave a little bit of you here with us. Everyone that is here this evening is here because of you, because of who you are and all the work you did to get to this point. And likely, each of us here tonight would share a different story or memory about you, both individually and as, as a class. To me, you are the class that brought it. You brought state titles. You brought school spirit. You are the senior class that brought an end to the pandemic that plagued your high school career. You brought national qualifiers. You brought laughs. You brought pranks. You brought kindness. You brought empathy. And you brought change. As you move on to your next chapter, I know that you will take a little bit of HHS with you. Take your smile, take your care, take your compassion, and continue to make this world a better place. And most importantly, know that you can always bring you back to Hermiston. Next, I would like to introduce School Board Chair, Ms. Ginny Holtis. On behalf of your Board of Education, I welcome all of you this evening. This class is special to me. 14 years ago, this class was starting preschool, and 14 years ago, I was appointed to the school board. We have been on this entire ride together, and it's been my pleasure to serve you and to watch you grow as you achieve this first really big accomplishment in your life. As you receive your diploma, proof that you have completed your required course load, there are some values I hope you have gained, and they won't be listed on your transcripts. However, along with your education, these will surely determine the kind of success you have with your life. So from a person slightly older than you, here are seven important values I hope that you have learned. I hope you have learned to be confident. The world appreciates confidence. There's a difference between confidence and arrogance. I hope you know that difference. Confidence comes from knowing and believing in yourself. I hope you learn the value of a good, firm handshake, square shoulders, and looking someone in the eye. That shows confidence. I hope that you learn to show respect for everyone that you come into contact with, to treat everyone you meet like you would like to be treated. I hope you learn to make good choices. From now on, every decision counts. Make good decisions, and even more importantly, be friends with those who also make good decisions. Your life in 10 years will largely be determined by the people you surround yourself with. So choose wisely. I hope that you learn the value of giving back to your community. Your time and talents are invaluable. Be an active participant. I hope you learn the value of teamwork and encouragement. If you expect someone to fail, they will likely not disappoint you, but a positive word or a smile can change someone's outlook and determination. Lead by example. I hope you learn personal responsibility, the value of commitment and of being on time. Be someone that others can count on. And I hope you never stop learning. And a little piece of advice. You may not know your future, you may not have it figured out today, but work at anything until you find your something. You don't have to love every job. That's why they pay you. But take pride in your ability to work and you will accomplish great things as you move forward. Graduates, congratulations, and keep making us proud. Thank you, Ms. Holthus. So, honor Guard, would you please uh, get ready to line this show and get it, and get it started, please? 
So parents, family, and friends, please bear with us for a few moments while we prepare the stage for the diploma presentations. I would like to start by thanking everyone once again for attending today and for your continued support for the past several years as we together watch our future generations grow into the young adults that they are today. Parents, as students uh, move beyond the stage, or behind, excuse me, behind the stage, they will be having their photo taken with a, with a diploma cover. They will then have another photo taken of them receiving the diploma up here on the stage. Presenting to diplomas this evening will be our board members and district administration. After the ceremony is over this evening, you can go ahead and start releasing, please. I'm gonna keep talking, we're buying some time here. After the, after the ceremony is over this evening, you will be able to meet with the graduates outside of the, on the east end uh, for, for pictures outside the building. Our graduates receive their official diploma, by the way, as they actually exit the building. And then, and then they can meet with you. Following the conclusion of the graduation, which is approximately 45 minutes from now, those graduates partic participating in Project Graduation will load buses at the roundabout, which is on the same end of this building, and, and travel to the Pacific Clinic. Those traveling back to Hermerson on a bus, you will load directly in front by the main doors, again, approximately 45 minutes after the conclusion of the ceremony. And thank you once again. Taylor Ward. <clears throat> Megan Palzinski. Jeffrey Romig. Elizabeth Doherty with honors and valedictorian. Julianne Bruce. Miranda Vivar. <laughs> Fernando Jimenez. <laughs> Giovanni Cisneros with honors. Julissa Izquierdo Magana. Leila Lucas with honors. Marisa Izquierdo Magana. <clears throat> Cricket Hook. Ethan Garcia with honors. Haley Gardner with honors. Dallin Barger with honors. Brooke Turner. Malin Purvis. Rafael Vargas. Kaylee Miller. Heavenly Coleman with honors. Kylie Wilson. Adriana Coleman with honors. Cassie Cummings. A Stephanie Diaz. Brian Davison. Adeline Valencia. Aiden West. Nayeli Gare Soto. Bradley Ayers. Zane Estes. Cody Adams. Brennan Nash. Samantha Monty. Cadence Cooley. 
Indy Loveland Young. Isela Eccles. Emily Iverson. Damon Maddox. Misha Meyer. Nathan Picard. Kylie Alvarez. Haley South. Jose Muñiz Silva. Macy Tovar. Erika Caldera Chairez. Adrian Alatore. Italy De La Paz. Gabriela Ambriz Viacana. Jesus Perez. Andrew Goller. Alvaro Rodriguez. Thank you. Lucas Junt. Thank you. Savannah Dickman. Casey Fisher. Landon Maddox. Kimberly De La Mora. Sina Beck. Astrea Silva Chavez. Kylie Temple. Henry Calamo Garcia. Yuteng Wang. Jordan Rhodes. Jacoby Cook. Omar Silva Isabeles. McKenna Smith. Yair Calamo Perez. Andres Carrillo Alatorre. Eduardo Diaz Cruz. Tanner Clayson. McKenna McGraw. Gabriela Flores Rios. Chastity De La Cruz. <laughs> Briseida Barrera Lozano. <clears throat> Jordan Sepulve Sepulveda, excuse me. Yitzel Mendoza. Yasmin Montes Velasquez. Marisol Mendoza Armenta. Karina Olvera. Madeline White. Aviana Velasco. Alan Osman. Jairo Bernal Hernandez. Dustin Hamilton. Carter Conger. Daniel Contreras. Alberto Amezcua Mendoza. Isaiah Jimenez. Noe Cortez. Khan Schlegel. Isaac Galjur. Tristan Day. Christina Irwin. Riker Browning. 
Yeah. Erika Victorio. Marco Orozco Lopez. Edgar Munoz Diaz. Ruby West. Jonathan Garcia. Matthew Enger. Hector Leal. Coleman Hill. Sergio Avila Ambriz. Isaac Thompson. Joscar Ortega Lopez. Isaiah Gonzalez. Ismael Orozco Monzon. Joseph Correa. Anjuar Salas. Ashley Penaloza. Adan Lopez. Zaira Escobedo. Aurora Shearer. James Hellinger. Lillian Herney. Aiden Favorite. Dylan Duquette. Kellen Joyce. <laughs> Sebastian Mendoza Rodriguez. Nicholas Perswell with honors. Travis Kammerzell. Helen Rohrman. Christopher Gosnell. <laughs> Cheyenne Clark. Gage Fricky, <laughs> Natalie Hoyos de la Paz. Okay. <clears throat> Alejandro Leon Mendoza. <laughs> Stacy Huber. <laughs> Anahi Garcia Diaz. Aiden Randall. Jasmine Berto Castro. Matthew Hall. Andrea Barajas. Cameron Robison. Eric Victoriano Avila. Braden Alexander Greywolf. Leslie Hernandez Macias. Colby Baker. Evelyn Yamas Ortiz. Victoria Kennedy. Marilyn Munoz Estrada. Jesus Nava. Alondra Corona Vergara. Xavier Mina with honors. Braceda Garcia. Nidia Molina Telez. Celestial Radcliffe. Evelyn Martinez. Cadence Herrera. Kimberly Velasquez Silva. Trinity Frederickson. Orlando Velasquez Silva. 
Garrett Caswell. Nayeli Murillo Muñiz. Benjamin Armstrong. Yareni Sofia Lopez. Miguel Huato. Pamela Ambriz Ponce. Isabella Gutierrez Garavito. Maria Guardado. Esther Mateo Toribio. Juan Alascar Alcazar Magaña. Excuse me. Asia Corey. Alexia Chairez. Noemi Pinedo Rodriguez. Anaceli Ibarra. Cristina Salas. Lorenzo Chavira. Christopher Ramos. Nathan Farias. Heidi Benitez Arista. Grayson Hendon. Pride Shelley. Yahir Gariegos Mejia. Aiden Ryan. Mikai Ruloff. Dallas Juarez. Kalea Rios. Isabella Gonzalez. Rose Parra. Rena Gorham with honors. Christian Medrano. Emily Swartfeger. Tristan Schloop. Amara Ferros with honors. Memphis Kane. Oscar Rodriguez. Caden Robbins. Tile Pomele. Seven Bar with honors. Madeline Moon. Jackson Gribscove. Ruby Ursua. Landon Schult. Marisol Lucatero. Cade Thomas. Francisco Limas. Emma Perkins. Connect Hernandez Espinoza. Briley Meekum. Noah Torre. Landon Gerard. Juan Mariscal Jr. Christopher Estrada Contreras with honors. Diana Govea. Uriel Angel. Kaylee Ordaz Garcia. Drew Acevedo. Karen Cardenas. Valerie Blayenberg with honors. 
Emma Kate Silva. Jacob Culligan with honors. Jenna Wally with honors. Everett Wicks. Connor Knutson. John Chastine. Leilani Gutierrez. Josue Cordoba with honors. Sloan Miller. Brian De La Paz with honors. Enrique Carrillo. Quinton Erickson. Eduardo Carrillo. Tama Tuya. Amber Aguilar. Andres Huizar. Sarita Caballero. Dominic Valencia. Piper Snyder. <laughs> Elizabeth Roldan. Kendall Muniz. Lorenzo Roldan. Nevea Alvarez. Erlen Delgado. Aiden Hagel. Joseph Marquith, honors and valedictorian. Alexandria McClure with honors. Tipia Pirianiti. Johnny Armstrong. <clears throat> Ivan Galvez. Giovanna Torres. Aiden Foreman. Thorin Foley. Natalie Atilano. Milo Ponce. Adriana Gutierrez Duran. Caitlin Johnson Torres. Stormy Richmond. Luis Zapata. Lucy Headings. Abraham Zapata. Caitlin Wadkins with honors. Rafael Martinez Panewa. Lydia Vanderstelt with honors. Raylin Hamilton. Ashley Treadwell. Sabrina Stoddard. Lydia Ortiz Lopez. Peyton Baxter. Delilah Luna Delgado. Maria Rojo Aguirre. Destiny Ortega. Rachel Garcia. Andres Salazar Arias. Brianna Solorio. Eliana Lopez Sanchez. Denis Arias. Nadia Gonzalez. Sergio Armenta Mendoza. 
Ivan Gutierrez Chavez. Christian Padilla. Christian Contreras Leal. Marcos Flores. Jules Bacon. Alexis Garcia Escalante. Cameron Boston with honors. Luciano Valencia Melendres. Brianna Mendoza. Aaron Perez Martinez. Conan Sedell. Dennis Van Soyek. Edwin Torres Ibarra. Harley Smith. Jorge Torres Ibarra. Renee Alexander. Edith Sanchez Castro. Jaron Dickens with honors. Andre Reddick. Brandon Vasquez Ocampo. Luis Lopez. Ramon Quirarte Banda. Emily Carrillo. Damian Avila. Nancy Salas. Jose Nieto Bajanero. Paola Hernandez Reyes. Ricardo Valenzuela. Lorena Guardado. Cesar Ramirez. Tallulah Cubbage Thorpe. Edgar Rosales. Alenis Bustamante Molina. Alexander Echeverria Garcia. Yanitza Villagrana Cardenas. Cesar Monclova. Monica Gonzalez. Faber Ortiz Macias. Anthony Miranda Estrada. Lucas Johnson. McKenna Dammeyer. Lane Siner. Rourke Smith. Ethan Cornia. Blake Mayberry. Ismael Arceo. Calvin Colpitz. Anthony Cisneros. Hector Lucas. Valencia. Angel Mendoza. Miguel Duran. Caden Badu. Jose Perez Medina. Mario Nava Jr. Edgar Quevedo Amparo. Devin Townsend. Elian Navarrete Blanco. Tucker Teal. Fernando Mejia Medrano. Austin Alder. 
Caden McQuain. Zachary Turner. Sonny Poirier. Pedro Pacheco Alvarado. Okay. Estefania Mota Sotelo. Jesse Bursell. Next, I would like to introduce Elizabeth Doherty for the farewell and the turning of the tassels. Today, as we stand here at the pinnacle of our high school years, I'm struck by the metaphorical resemblance between life and a book. Each of our lives can be seen as a unique story with chapters that have unfolded in different ways. While the content of our books may have differed, up until now the structure of our books has been more or less the same. In chapter one, we were innocent babies. In chapter two, we embarked on our journey through elementary school. In chapter three, we navigated the challenges of middle school. And now, in chapter four, we have arrived at the culmination of our high school experience. Today, we not only mark the end of our high school chapter, but also the end of the shared narrative that has bound us together. As we turn the page from our high school chapter to the unwritten pages of our future, the song Wide Open Spaces by the Dixie Chicks serves as a perfect soundtrack to this pivotal moment. Just like the lyrics of the song, our high school years have been a time of discovery, growth, and the widening of our horizons. We entered this school as young and impressionable freshmen with minds full of curiosity and hearts bursting with dreams. And over the years, we have been fortunate enough to explore a vast landscape of knowledge, opportunities, and friendships that have expanded our understanding of the world. Our teachers, mentors, friends, and families have been our guides, encouraging us to step outside our comfort zones and embrace those wide open spaces. They have nurtured our talents, sparked our curiosity, and shaped us into the individuals we are today. To our support systems, we express our deepest gratitude for opening our minds and helping us embrace the vastness of the world around us. Now, as we prepare to close this chapter of our lives, we must remember that the wide open spaces symbolize more than just physical boundaries. They represent the opportunities and possibilities that await us. We stand here today on the brink of adulthood, ready to spread our wings and explore these wide open spaces. It may be daunting, but it is also exhilarating. It is a chance to define who we are, to chase our dreams, and to make a difference in the world. So, my fellow graduates, let us embrace the closing of this chapter and the opening of the wide open spaces that await us. Let us carry the lessons we have learned, the connections we have made, and the dreams we hold dear. As we turn the page to the next chapter of our lives, may we face the unknown with courage, determination, and the knowledge that we are the authors of our own stories. And as our paths diverge, may we never forget the friendships, the laughter, and the shared moments that have shaped our high school chapter. Now, it is my honor to lead in the turning of the tassels, which symbolizes the transition from Hermiston High School student to Hermiston High School graduate. Class of 2023, please rise. Turn your tassels from right to left. Congratulations.
It is my pleasure to present the Hermiston High School Class of 2023.